Trump and Sarah Sanders just found White House leaker, now they're making him pay big time. For months now, someone in the White House has been leaking sensitive information to the public, putting national security at risk and gravely undermining the Trump administration's progress. It was only a matter of time before President Donald Trump and one of the top officials in his administration, White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders, identified the culprit, and it appears that they have. Now, Trump and Sanders are making the leaker pay for his bad behavior, as they should. Rep. Adam Schiff, D.C.A., doesn't have the best name recognition in Washington, D.C., but lately, He's been working diligently to change that by doing two things in particular, namely, getting in front of the camera any chance he gets to trash President Trump and leaking sensitive White House information. If you're one of the millions of Americans who have no idea who Rep. Schiff is, Daily News Briefing provided a solid summary of his background. If you are familiar with Adam Schiff at all you know that he has no interest in the truth or working across the aisle. He's a partisan who only cares about advancing his liberal agenda and bashing Trump. He also loves being on TV. Every time there is a camera around you will find Adam Schiff running with the phony Russian narrative or hurling some wild accusation at Trump. Yep, that pretty much sums up Adam Schiff. After rumors began spreading over the past few months that Schiff was the one who has been leaking sensitive White House intelligence to the public. President Donald Trump blatantly called him out in a Thursday interview with the Wall Street Journal. All I see of these Democrats, like Adam Schiff, it's all he does, he'll have a meeting, and then he'll leave, and he'll call up the meeting, and then I'll have a meeting and then he'll leave, said Trump. He left meetings where people are being interviewed, and then all of a sudden they say a story about what's going on inside the meetings, added the president leaving no doubt that he believes Schiff is the leaker. President Trump and White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders both accused California Rep. Adam Schiff of selectively leaking details of the House Intelligence Committee's Russia investigation. Trump put Schiff on blast during an interview with The Wall Street Journal in the Oval Office on Thursday morning. Source, The Daily Caller Schiff demanded an apology from the White House in an apparent attempt to defend himself. However, he did not expressly come out and deny that he was responsible for the leaks, which is very telling. They owe me an apology, but frankly it would be a wasted errand to ask for one, Schiff said on CNN. And if Sarah Huckabee Sanders is going to have to give out apologies to everyone that he has criticized unfairly, she would be doing nothing else all day. Rep. Adam Schiff, Democrat California said Thursday that the White House owes him an apology after Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders accused him of leaking House Intelligence Committee interviews to the press. Source, The Hill Frankly, President Donald Trump and Sarah Sanders handled this brilliantly. If lawmakers like Adam Schiff want to play dirty by betraying the president's trust and leaking information to the press, then they're only getting a taste of their own medicine when the president himself calls them out in front of the entire nation. If Adam Schiff was trying to make a name for himself, he has certainly accomplished as much. Unfortunately for him, that name is now synonymous with the word traitor. Word traitor.